How to create a table in a Microsoft Word 2007 document. If you find yourself needing to create a table in your Word document, you'll find the steps to do so um, rather easy. For this example, um, let's look at the weekly sales figures for a company. We'll assume that we have uh, three salespeople and there are five days in the business week. Since we'll want a label for the days of the week, uh, we'll want four columns, uh, one for each salesperson and one to label the days of the week. Uh, there are five days of the week. Uh, when you include the header row, that makes for six. So we'll want to draw a table that is four columns wide by six rows high. To get started, we simply click the Insert tab, and then we click Table. And we're immediately prompted to um, create our table simply by indicating the number of rows and columns we want. The thing that's really cool about Microsoft Word 2007 is that a lot of things are previewed for you as you make your choices. So as you can see, as we, as we make our decision about how many rows and columns we'd like here, it actually shows us what that table would look like, which is just really helpful in terms of realizing, A, what it is you're doing, and B, um, getting a better sense as to maybe if you want to change some of your parameters. But in this case, we're pretty sure we want uh, four columns by six rows. So that's three, four, five, six, and there we go, four columns by six rows. Great. We can uh, label our day of the week by putting day and putting uh, the three salespeople's names. In this case, uh, it's uh, Jim, Sue, and Bob. And the days of the week will be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and right. And now we'll just put in uh, some some sample sales figures. Uh, Jim did 400, and then he did 200, and then he bounced back and did 300, and he kept going with 450, and then big 500 on Friday. Sue started out with 1,000, and 1,200, and then 850, and just some more sample data and this slow ending. And then with Bob, he did some other sales data. Okay. Now I probably just want to change this text so it's not bold, so things stand out more. But in any event, uh, pretty simple stuff, but an example of a table in a Microsoft Word document. In this case, we track the uh, sales figures for three salespeople over the course of uh, five business days. Uh, if you'd like to delete the table, the thing that's really cool uh, with Word 2007 is uh, you can very easily uh, do so by using the eraser tool. And you do that by simply clicking in the table, which brings up the table tools um, part of the ribbon, and then click the eraser button, and then simply select the entire table, and there it is. It's all gone. So there you go. How to create a table in a Microsoft Word 2007 document. For more helpful training videos, please go to chisholm-consulting.com.